Happy Easter! Oh Easter, it's a time of bunnies and life and love and friendship and hardly any Lovecraftian abominations chasing you down dark corridors from the depths of your deepest horrible nightmares whatsoever. Uh, obviously I thought Easter morning was an ideal time to uh, pick up on a promise I made long ago to play Amnesia until my inevitable screaming death. In my defense I've made a surprising amount of progress without dying, um, but uh, I also think it's very understandable why I've been putting off this project for a long time, especially after the last time I did this I just did a great two hour long marathon where probably the most frequently uttered thing was, yeah I could probably stop now, yeah I could probably stop now, yeah that's been enough, and then, oh. It was deeply traumatizing. Even sat here just listening to the creepy ambience in the background. I could just feel my heart being like, Oh, better pick up the pace a little bit. Oh, yeah, something's going on. Wouldn't want to get spooked now. Yeah, I've also made the mistake of turning up the volume a bit louder because I. Last time I kept like talking over sound effects and then I'd be like, whoa, what was that? Whoa, what was that? And then I started imagining sounds, which if anything was actually quite amusing to listen to, but um Yeah. Stuff. Amnesia, fuck it, why not? Even the main menu, the music on the main menu sounds like Satan farting sinisterly into a tuba, which uh Sets the tone quite nicely. But here we are, Amnesia, you know how it works. Two minutes of rambling. I was uh, checking my inventory and uh, couldn't help but notice we got we got shit tons of tinder boxes. If you have if you ever need tinder boxes, Daniel Toffee Mouth is your man, but uh, the precious oil is considerably less less uh, abundant. Hmm. If only I was Octodad, I could just make some more But yeah, last time we fell down the lift of definitely not going to break Enus. And now we're here, going to a prison, I seem to recall. <laughs> God. It can't be worse than the storage doom. The storage doom was, was much too much. Ugh. Oh. Come on, Daniel. <laughs> I've managed to wedge this sideways in the doorway. This this reminds me of an ins <laughs> I've already been sidetracked. This Just because I'm desperate to avoid going through that doorway, probably. I An incident at Legoland, when... <laughs> I was in a boat with some friends on one of those little boat rides and I managed to like steer the boat sharply to one direction and got it wedged sideways in the canal and a man had to come along and kick us free. And my reason for trying to turn the boat sharply was to beat like an eight year old child in the race, which wasn't even really a race. Ah, uh, I'm a horrible human being. On, uh, speaking of horrible, oh look. Oh god, I can hear Daniel's teeth chattering or whatever they are. Oh. Uh, uh, it would be the loudest fucking door in the known universe. Yeah, so let's just keep that door open. Oh, uh. Nope. Okay, okay, okay. Let's tinderbox this shit. Because, uh. I, I like to live dangerously. I can already feel my banter failing. Ooh, maggots. Maggots, creepy crawlies. <laughs> God, this, when I'm looking at my screen right now, it's just blackness, the occasional droplet from the ceiling. I can't see anything. Oh. Oh. Well, it's been fun playing Amnesia, but uh, I have other things to do now. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Enough enough screaming, please. I like that they mess with the FOV when you start going crazy. It really is actually quite disorientating to go from like 90 to 60. It's like, oh my god, suddenly I'm playing on a console. LOL. Speaking of consoles, I was going to try and play this with a controller today because I didn't realise that was an option, but it wouldn't let me uh, lean. There was no function on the control mapping for the controller that lets you lean, even though I don't recall that the D-pad is set to anything, and I've played console games where the controller lets you lean. Not very many. Actually, you can do that in Call of Juarez Gunslinger. Another another good game, by the way. I'm talking about anything other than what I'm playing, you may have noticed. God damn it, Daniel! 
Five minutes in, we've made made ten feet of progress. Oh, I love how warm and welcoming the fire is. Fine, okay, we're doing this. Doing this. Oh, God. Uh, just remind myself, does opening the inventory not actually pause the game? I, I suspect it doesn't. Yes, very wrong. Very, very wrong. I'm inclined to agree. Ooh. <sighs> well, at least we found a nice place to uh, hang out with the rats in the dark with no door to even close behind us. Oh, a tinderbox. I don't have enough of those. Could use some more oil. I like how the developers were probably figuring out by this point that people liked to close doors behind them, so they're like, eh, no fucking doors for you now. I kind of want to see if there's anything useful in this room other than just rats and whatever that pile of something is in the corner. Oh, you can move this. That's usually a good sign. <laughs> Why didn't I say I was going to play a nice game? Something actually related to Easter. Bunny rabbits. Oh god, something smashed its way through this door. I did not like that one bit. <sighs> so wait, 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 wait a minute. Is there, is, there's no map, is there? Of course there isn't. Um, <laughs> I think this is just a dead end down here. Uh, be a light there, Daniel. Be a light. Praise, praise that fucking sun, sun. Okay, run, 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 run. Ooh! Just, just charging my batteries. Please don't hiss at me, ungodly things in the darkness. <sighs> When you're in the light, you just can't see anything that's in the dark, which I like. This, this game's very clever in its technical details. <sighs> I am feeling again the need to apologize for being so goddamn slow, but this is your assurance that I'm legit here. I'm not one of those, eh, scary, woo, people, except for those times when I have recorded myself sounding like that. Hypocrisy. But you know what I mean, this is, uh, I'm genuinely not enjoying myself. Down we go. Down. Shit. Oh god. Oh, I see you. Uh, uh. That's that's the monster. It's a monster. Go around the corner. God. <sighs> At least my Lego boat might be blocking the door. <sighs> oh, fuck. Hello? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh! Wait a minute. How did he get through the door if he just had to smash it in just now? Fucking AI? Glitchy piece of shit. <laughs> oh, my immersion. Well, at least we've had a near-death experience ten minutes in. Here I was, like, 30 seconds before that happened, I complained nothing was happening. <laughs> Ambient screaming is not calming me down. So what have we learned? Um, the AI is a cheating motherfucker. That's a good lesson to learn. Oh, fucking God. Daniel, will you stop crunching in your ears? I'm actually quite suspicious that this does pause the game now, yeah, because it pauses- yeah, it does, okay, okay. That's a surprising mercy. 
Definitely not going to get eaten by monsters. God, like, I just. I. Is he still. What? There's a lot of rustling going on. Really did just break the door down. <laughs> Doors, my one weapon, have been rendered useless. Um, <sighs> you know, just for a relaxing variety. Let's look at my journal. Uh, notes, yes. Oh yes, oh yes. Uh, it's very, very interesting. Um, I can't actually remember what I meant to do. Oh no, no mementos available. Never mind. No comforting notes. Ooh, ooh, ooh. If he's around the other side of this doorway, I'm just, I'm just gonna, just, just, nope. <laughs> Does he have anything better to do with his life than ruin my life? I realize it must not be a particularly nice life being a horrible monster, but, uh... <sighs> okay, there are two possibilities now. He's either dead ahead, and the same thing's gonna happen. Oh, he's around that corner, and he's gonna sneak up on me as I try to get that way. Oh, he's just gonna teleport behind me because the game's a cheating bitch. Hope that's a shadow, not a monster shadow. I wish I knew some Easter songs. Anybody in here? Nope, thank you. Oh dear, jeez. <sighs> Bathe in the golden glow. I sure hope monsters can't actually see the light. <laughs> Given that he fucking looked me right in the eyes a minute ago, it didn't seem to see me. This would be a good time to mention that uh, not only do I still have the lovely computer donated by Mr. And Mrs. Gutierrez, running joke, I have since upgraded it with a Gain Ward Phantom GTX 760, I believe it is, which is a GPU that is so lovely. It lets me play the Titan Falls at 60 FPS. It is good, very much good. Yes. <laughs> See, that man is screaming in agreement. Yeah, this is good. Oh, so. Hopefully, Amnesia is looking even more beautifully hideous now. <sighs> Just, oh, God. Okay, there's a room with light down here, but I'm not convinced that's a good thing. Okay. Yep, okay. Not brave enough to put the, the torture on, I'm afraid. Okay, the music tells me it's safe. <sighs> I think the hard mode of playing this game would probably be to turn the lights off. Oh my god, I can feel my mouse sliding weirdly as he goes crazy. Oh, I share your pain, Daniel. Okay. Wait a minute now. Wait a minute. Do something ballsy. Oh, I can't do something ballsy. Won't let me because there's no Tinder in there. Fuck's sake, Daniel. <laughs> I can, I can, it's really weird how I can just feel my mouse is not moving properly anymore. <laughs> so, how are you doing? It's a fine day, you think? Oh god, an open door. Please be good news. Light sources, please. Lights. 
Camera. Oh, what's this? Oil! Oil! Oh, fuck! Fuck! <laughs> Thank you. Oh, so for that. Must be digging in here. Or oh, a landslide has occurred. Actually, what's that? Is that just a bucket? That's just a bucket, isn't it? Fuck it. Fuck it, bucket. Oh, some mouldy bread. Delicious. <laughs> it's, it's probably rock hard, at least. I can use it as a very valuable weapon. Oh. Oh god, I just needed some water right there. Just. Oh! Storage doom. I thought we were. We were done with the storage doom. Okay, I found a room I can hide in with a door. Not that the doors slow them down, but. Uh, I'm just completely turned around now. All the doors open outwards. Of course they do. I kept expecting there to be like closing the door and just catch a glimpse of him coming around the corner and going, "You!" <laughs> Doing like the uh, body snatches scream. Oh. The Outrider. That's a badass name. Who will make pancakes just the way I like them? Ooh, this is kinky. I'll cover the hole with the bed. Oh, oh. Everything will be fine. I promise. Lie back and think of England. <laughs> Why do I make everything sexual? It's because of all the fucking Lovecraftian shit going on here. How can I not be thinking of Freud? Oh, God. A fucking candle. Oh. It's so pretty. Fucking. It was blowing my mind looking on Steam today. Oh, God. <laughs> that was just someone crying. I thought that was the sound of the door squeaking open from outside. <sighs> it was blowing my mind looking on Steam today that this game came out in almost five years ago now. It'll be five years in September, and I'm thinking, Jesus Christ. It's fucking old ass game is what this is. I still haven't bothered to try getting Amnesia 2 just because I've I've heard almost nothing but bad things. Anyway, that cutscene told me there's something significant about this room. Ew. Ew. I don't know what this is, but I should probably stop rolling around in it. Mm. There's like bits of a chair in here. Actually, yes, there's something about a hole. Maybe that's like an escape tunnel. Oh! Oh. The, the hole is too tight. Daniel is too big to squeeze into the hole. Oh dear, a common problem. Well, I guess that's an objective then, because I just scribbled something down. What's he, what's he said? Oh yes, there's the blocked gate. Oh, I need to like smash it or something. Or maybe I just need to go in the hole. Oh, okay. Um, do I have any obvious tools I could use here, or do I, could I just smash something against it? Like this bucket, make a loud noise, trying to smash through the hole. Yeah, okay, I immediately regret that. Oh, yeah, should never do that again. <laughs> Fuck. I like how I've also been using my precious lantern oil, even though I have a source of fire right here. The question once again does occur, why doesn't he just take the goddamn infinite candle with him, but I suppose then you can like extinguish it and relight it very helpfully. Whatever. These and many other things are topics that... <laughs> these are interesting mechanical ideas that Machine for Pigs did not tackle. Fucking Machine for Pigs. I mean, I already thought that Amnesia could have done with a bit more inventory stuff, you know, a bit more mechanical, interesting stuff going on. It is a bit minimalistic in some places. And then Machine for Pigs comes along and says, Yeah, we, don't, we have too many mechanics. Get rid of all that. Have I even been in here? I'm not sure. No. Yes. Yes, this is the place. Oh, look, look, I'm going I'm to put this in the middle of the doorway, you know, so I know I've been here. There's, there's the buckets and the bread. So if I trip over and break my neck, I'll know at least I've been here before. Oh god, which way did I come from now? I don't know. <sighs> At least I know where to go. <laughs> I think the game would be considerably less terrifying if it had a map though, even if it was like a really crappy map that didn't show you where you were. 
I think it's that, that's, that sense of disorientation is half of why it's so effective. Okay. Ah, another safe, lovely room. With hardly any teleporting monsters. Do you think they designed those doors so it's just impossible to close them quietly? Oh! Where oh! Is she? Oh! Where did she go? <laughs> no! Oh, tell! I'll never tell you! You're just making things worse. Look, this is no place for a young girl all by herself. Oh, she Daniel. Or worse, there's no telling what horrors await down there. Oh, getting a bit, getting a bit rough there, Daniel. Oh. 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 What? 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 How was he here before? Oh, the plot thickens. What? I saw what might be like the top of someone's head there, and I was like, Eek! but it's actually just a torch, I think. Okay, not complaining.